Welcome back to Tea Facts. In today's episode, we're diving into the tumultuous journey of Brie Muller, the third stew from season nine of Below Deck Mediterranean. Struggling to keep her job aboard the luxurious superyacht Moustique, Brie has found herself in the spotlight as the underdog of this season. Despite the glamour of yachting, she hasn't successfully completed a charter season in her career, often feeling overwhelmed and falling behind in her duties. This season, Brie is not alone. She's joined by several new cast members, and together they face their fair share of criticism. Chef Jonathan Schillingford's questionable culinary creations and Bozen Ian McLean's management skills have also raised eyebrows. On top of all this, a romantic rivalry has emerged between Brie and second stew, Elena Ellie Dubach, both vying for the attention of deckhand Joe Bradley, which has added an extra layer of tension to the crew dynamics. Brie's role as third stew is vital, with responsibilities like laundry and housekeeping weighing heavily on her shoulders. Unfortunately, her inexperience has led to major hiccups right from the start. She struggled with the laundry equipment, leading to misplaced items for both guests and crew. Ellie questioned Bree's capabilities, putting further pressure on her already fragile confidence. Bree's journey is not just about the job, it's also about her background. Coming from a privileged upbringing, she admitted to being sheltered and lacking the adult responsibilities that others might have faced. This adds to the complexity of her struggles aboard the Mystique, making her transition into this high-pressure environment all the more daunting. Initially, Brie and Ellie's relationship seemed promising, with Ellie mentoring Brie in essential housekeeping tasks. However, the sparks of rivalry ignited when both women showed interest in Joe, leading to passive-aggressive exchanges and a rapid breakdown of their partnership. Ellie even accused Brie of keeping a burn book to document her mistakes, further intensifying the conflict. Things escalated dramatically when Ellie irresponsibly left Brie with an excessive workload right before guests were due to return. Frustrated, Bri frantically tried to catch up, but Ellie's berating only added to her distress. It was a pivotal moment. While Brie was close to breaking down, she displayed incredible resilience and professionalism, asking Captain Sandy Yon to postpone their conversation until after the guests were dealt with. Despite the chaos, Captain Sandy has remained a supportive figure for Brie, recalling her own early struggles and vowing not to give up on her. She encouraged Bray to control her emotions and focus on her growth. However, tension between Brie and Ellie culminated in a dramatic meeting with Sandy, where both stews were given an ultimatum. Resolve their issues or risk losing their jobs. Brie argued that their attempts at reconciliation had failed, underscoring the escalating drama. Throughout this season of Below Deck Mediterranean, we've witnessed Bree's transformation. From her initial struggles to improved organizational skills and prioritizing guest needs, she's come a long way. However, the personal drama with Ellie still looms as a significant threat to her success. Will Bree Muller manage to find her footing in a chaotic environment and overcome the challenges posed by her rivalry with Ellie? Only time will tell. Thanks for watching TFAX where we bring you the latest and juiciest updates from your favorite reality shows. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more entertaining content.